Hey, girls. Hello. Hello. Let, oh, Lord. <clears throat> oh, my. Happy Monday. Happy, Happy beginning Monday. of the week. We are excited. We are. We're so excited. To be into Daniel 10. We're excited for the new year to really see what God is going to do in 2024. And we hope you are, too. You know, we're, we're hoping for hope. We are so hoping for hope. Yeah, we have hope. to have hope that the Lord heard our prayers. Yes. Right? Mm -hmm. That he sees us, you know, when we're down. And that um, that he is who he says he is. Yeah. Yeah. Without a doubt. Yeah. And so um, today's Bible study is a message of hope. It sure is. And we it is hope. a message of hope. He has a message of hope. And we pray that when you all go read Daniel 10 yourselves, yeah, that yeah. you guys see hope and feel hope. That's what we want. When, when you're in there. When yeah. you're in, in the moment and you're journaling yeah. the STARS method and you're going through all of that, then you're mm -hmm. like, Lord, I see you. I understand. You know, thank you for hearing me when, when mm -hmm. I prayed the first time. It yeah. wasn't the 20th time that I prayed, but it was the first time. Yeah. But I pray that you yeah. heard it. That you heard yeah. it. Yep. And that's exactly what we want. So, yeah. hello, comment. Let us know what you're, if you're watching. Because yes. like, we can't see. We can't, we can't see. see. We'll not let Your us friend. see who we you cannot are. See. So, unless you comment, we don't know. We don't know. And guess what? Someone has to do a recap. Oh, my goodness. I was not ready to do a Someone recap. Someone has to do a recap. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see. Let's see how fast I can do it. Yeah. Can she do it? I don't think I can. Under a minute. I can't do it under a minute. I wish you could do your voice that you like to do. Hi, Val. Hi, Val. Hi, lovely Ari. Hi, lovely. Okay, so I have this oh, thing. Oh, do you want me to say it? Yeah. Can she do it in under a minute? Let's wait and let's see. <laughs> Join us today when we and Girl Open Your Bible go live to study Daniel 10. Can she do it? Let us know if you think she can. <laughs> Tonight at 5 p.m. Central Standard Time. I love you. <laughs> Y'all, we will be watching TV, and out of nowhere, Charity will talk in that Hi, voice. Elizabeth. And I'm like, what is happening? She's like, stop it, please. Stop, stop, <laughs> stop. No, I, the first time I heard it, her and her mother were going back and forth like this. Yeah, we love to do it when we're yeah. trying to decide a movie that we want to watch. And so when we're reading the synopsis of the movie, you yeah. do it, you do it in whatever voice you choose. Yeah. How about we change change it up tonight? <laughs> and let's have Charity do the recap, but uh, just like not. that. Let's not do that. It's okay. your turn. Well, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. We're I tried to pass it. Yeah, you did. You did. You did. You did. You tried to pass the buck, but it's okay. Keep okay. Up. So can she do it in less than All right. a minute? So Shall this see. This recap. Hi Kenya. Welcome. Hi Kenya. Hi Vaughn. This recap is for the ones who are new. Yes. Yes. Uh, I'm gonna try my best to do it in a minute because we value the replay. Yes. Um, and we want to make sure you guys can get into Daniel 10. However, there is there's some beauty that is happening in Daniel 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. There's just so much beauty here. So there I'm gonna is. try to do my there best. Is to recap in one minute. If I don't make it in one minute, Lord, I pray, Father, I pray, Father, right now, that the woman on the side of my voice understand who they are in the story and that you are with them in the fire, you're with them in the lion's den. In mm -hmm. Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Okay. Here we go. Count, cue me go. up. Okay, so as we know, in Daniel 1, uh, we hear about King Nebuchadnezzar, we hear that he's having these dreams. But also, this happens again and again and again and again, where this king is having dreams, and he doesn't first go to the man of God, he doesn't first go to Daniel, mm -hmm. the one who has insight, the one that's been fasting, the one, you know, mm -hmm. that, that he trusts, the one who always interprets, he goes to the witches, he goes to all these things, he goes to the things that fall flat. That is like you and I. We go to okay. the things Ooh. that fall flat first, like we go to food, I can't wait till we do this oh challenge, starting January 2nd, where we, we run to food, we run to any people we run all these things instead of running to who first god. god and so we see that on repeat over and over and over and over again and then eventually he has to do what he has to go run to daniel yes he has to go run to god and get the insight so he does that but then his then his son becomes king and his son be tripping because his son act like he didn't learn the lessons from his daddy yes. like he didn't learn and so for those of you 
who who else have generational curses for those of you mm. who have family issues with health learn from the oh, past of the our past. Your, of your yeah. mothers and of yeah. your fathers wow he just gave that to me and i'm done i think that's okay. all okay okay i think she that's did all. you know one minute five that, seconds. Was, that, that was that was really something good. outside of the lion's den something outside of the fiery funners is remember Ooh. remember 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 there are signs that the lord is giving you there's there's writing on the mm. walls pay attention it is so true pay attention because there are some things where we don't have to learn it ourselves yeah. we can learn it from other people we, exactly and some of us are hard-headed where we're like, mean? God, you just gonna have to take me through it because I can't see it. Yeah. And I'm tired of it. I'm so sick of it. Don't and do that. You don't know that do don't that. make sense. And I think for <laughs> some of us, we gotta say, I don't wanna learn it the hard way, Father. Yes, yes. Give yes. it to me in a sign yes. outside of my body, yes. outside of me. Right. Give it to me with somebody else. Remind me yes. what happened. Yes, yes. Because sometimes I know there'll be times where I'm like, yes. well, Lord, show me this and show me that. Yeah. And you know, one way that he can do that yeah. is to show me how I'm not doing something. Oh, I can remember one time <laughs> I was talking to one of my brothers and he made a mistake and he did something and I secretly judged him for that. And I was like, oh my gosh, he really has something to do with it. And then it was something about influencing someone um, in, like, in what they were eating, right? I'll say that. And so, well, actually, I'll just tell the truth. He, um, there was someone who was dealing with um, uh, alcoholism. And so they were out one night. My brother was like, oh, man, I'll just buy you a drink. And he was saying how bad he felt because he told the friend that he would buy him a drink. And after that, the friend relapsed. And he felt bad for that. And I secretly judged him for that. At this time, my brother told me, he was like, I'm not drinking. Right? He told me that. And um, we went out and... I bought him a drink and God showed me instantly. He was like, look what you did. Look what you did. You secretly judged him for those five minutes and I turned it right around on you because I made you forget that he even said that. Yeah. And how easy it was for you to just say, oh yeah, I'll buy you a, 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 a Mardi Gras a daiquiri. You know what I mean? And it was like, I saw it. I was like, oh my God, that's how easily we can do things and how easily we need to remember how remember. easily you know remember. Yes. we can forget yes we can forget hmm. you know but god can do those kind of things He's like oh okay so that was just something that you would never do that right yeah it's just you like the never do that song um yeah roses really smell like boo boo mm. like when <laughs> you, you love that part <laughs> oh my god <laughs> You know, like you think your stuff don't stink. Yeah, yeah. Lean a little closer and see. Yes. Roses, yes. your roses smell like boo boo. <laughs> and because, uh, come on, yes, me too. Yes, me too. Me like, too. We all can fall. I'll be reading the Bible. I'll be looking, looking at these kings. I'm like, oh my god, how did they? Yeah. <laughs> how did they forget that God is good? And yes. The only, that God gave yes. the dream. How did they keep going to get these dreams interpreted by other people? And they could just go directly to the Father. And that's what we've been challenging everyone yes. to do. You get a dream, go, go directly to the Father. Go directly to Him. God, what does this mean, right? And so, anyway, all that to say, all that to say, we also what we forget mostly all the yeah. time is that God is with us, yes. right? Is Jesus' so name us. is Emmanuel. That's God with us. Yes. And so we forget. We be, you know, struggling in, in the battle. And we're like, oh, I feel so lonely. I'm but alone. it's hard in the battle. It's so hard. It's in hard the battle. in the battle. And don't we think that uh, Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego finally said it right in order? Ooh, you yes, know, you did. You felt, got her. <laughs> <laughs> they find they they were in the dark, you know. Lions Den or Fiery Purse. They thought like, it was over. They thought it was over. Like, we finna go, we, we finna go see the father, it, right? We about yeah. to go see him. And they did see him, but not in the way that they thought. But they thought that it was over for them. Yes. They were going to die. And some of you feel like mm. that. And the Lord's like, remember, yeah. I am with, with you. you. I am with you in the fire. Yeah. I am with you in the fight. Yeah. And so yeah. here we are in Daniel 10. Mm -hmm. Remember that the Lord is with, with Daniel. Yeah. And he can hear Daniel's prayer. That's so he so can hear you, daughter. He can yes. hear you. He hears your he prayer. He does hear us. He hears you. You know, he says in his word, and it's one of my favorite scriptures, yeah. right? If my people who are called by my name will humble themselves yes. and pray 
and seek my face yeah. and turn from their evil ways, I will forgive their sins. And then what? I will hear from heaven. I'll hear I will hear from heaven. From heaven. I will forgive their sins and I will hear their land. And sometimes we think about land. It's like, okay, yeah, the land. Of the, no, yeah. we're talking about our land, your land. What yes. is your land? What is your your land? land might be your health. Yep. Your land might yes. be your finances. Yes. You know, our land can be so many things. It was like, Lord, I need you to come in here and heal this thing. It might be relationship. Yes. It can be so many things mm. that we need God to heal. Yes. Speak that thing back to him. Speak Pray to it. your father. Mm. And he says that he will hear you. He will hear you. I will forgive your sins. Right. You know, I will hear from heaven. I will hear from heaven. And I will heal your land. So the, our biggest In that favorite, order. In that order. So first of all, that was the beautiful instructions. That was beautiful instructions. That, and that was scripture. Open his word. Yes. Get the yes. instructions. Yep. Get the instructions. Yeah. And so in Daniel 10, we briefly, we like to read it with you guys. And we know that calls for a yeah. long lot. Yeah. It just does. Yeah. It does just does and so with that being said we're going to just start reading like little sections maybe there's just a little, little section just because little we want to empower you guys to go read it uh just go read it for yourself yeah, so yeah. You, you guys have time to apply it yes because all scripture is applicable mm -hmm. it just is you can figure out your daniel if you're you know mm -hmm. somewhere else somewhere yes. else in these darn yes. parts who are you yep. the, yep. and ask lord who am i are you the king that's disobeying are you the king that's sometimes disobeying? we think that you know we're the knight in shining army yeah. and it's like nah um, you don't you the one who oppressing people girl you the one you know who believe in the lies okay you the one saying the lies yeah you the one like uh. but it's just like the lord to say that so you could do what what did she say so you can repent and turn yeah. so you can hear from yeah. you yeah and he yeah. He wants to answer all the things. He does. He does. And one of he the things. He will answer all the things. And so you will repent. And one of the things that I like most about that particular scripture. Yeah. Um, it, he talks about humble themselves and pray yeah. and turn from their wicked ways. It doesn't yeah. say humble yourselves, turn from your wicked ways and then pray. No. no, it says pray and turn from your wicked ways, whatever your wicked ways could be. Yeah. Right. Because that could be so many different things. It, it doesn't have so to be um, an, an yeah. idol statue that you're bowing down to. Yeah. Right. It could just not be turning to God instead. It could be going to people first instead of going yes. to God. And these are things that we all do. So please don't think, you know, like yes. raise, raise your hand first. I raise my hand first before raise anybody else says anything. But we need him to turn from those wicked ways. Yeah, we some do. of those addictions do, and things, some of those addictions and things that we have. He has to do. He it. has to do it because we can't do it. it. And People suffer with say, addictions Father, for decades. I'm ready. Take it. Yeah. Father, yeah. I'm ready. Take or get it. so deep into your word get, that all oh. of a sudden you don't even have the desire for it anymore. Exactly. He is the only one who can do that. So we believe the more that you open, the more that you yeah. read. The, the closer you will feel to the father yes, right and yes. the closer you feel to the father you don't want to you don't want none of that mm -hmm. stuff you don't mm -hmm. want any of that and so yeah. that's what we're challenging you all to do yeah is get closer to him this is personal this is so personal open and read yeah read this like it's the best netflix series okay. of your life okay read this get in to it. Yes, yes. This is good. It is. This it is. is sweet. Yes. This tastes like heaven. Yeah. This yeah. this our Bibles, our word, his word is alive. Yep. And we yep. all know it in our hearts. Yep. And so, and that's where he is. Telling us, okay, this is where you at in the story. This is how I'm gonna pull you out, or this is this is what this is our next yeah. step. Yeah. Get the path forward. Yeah. Because his word is a lighted path. And so anyway. So we are going to read maybe verse 12 through 18. It's yeah, a lot of, a lot of fearless yes, talk right yes, here. Yes. So I guess I'll set the stage up for you guys. So in, in chapter 9, Daniel is praying, and an angel comes visit him while he's praying, and the angel says, the Lord had, the, Lord, the angel gives him the answer immediately, yeah, right? Yeah. He gives the interpretation, he gives him the answer immediately. And then after that, Daniel is sick, y'all. Because he just found out mm -hmm. what he wanted. It ain't yeah. going to happen. He he's not going to see it. He won't see it. It will eventually happen, but yeah, he won't, but he see, won't it. see it. 
And we want, I know all of us, like, I want to see it, 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 I want to see it. Sometimes you don't see it. Something that looks like our ancestors, right? There's things that they prayed for, right? That they did not that see. they did not get to see. And what we pray is that, Lord, may, let let it be me. Yes, I want to see it in the land of the living. That's I want to see about it last in the time. land of the living. Yeah. And so here we are in Daniel 10, and Daniel's like, I am so yeah. sick. Yeah. I didn't eat. I didn't anything. I didn't eat anything bad for three weeks. This is how it starts. Yeah. And then I didn't eat anything bad for three weeks, right? And I understood. And that's mm-hmm. something y'all yeah. need a yeah. detox, right? And that is what we're going to do with yeah. the challenge. Yeah. We're going to detox. Yeah, we need to detox. We need we to get detox. all of that stuff out. And I'm telling you, there is something about, and Sierra and I have been talking about this, there is something to be said and something about when we're eating better and how we hear. Yes, it, it just is. It just is, guys. And we see it here. We see, we see it literally it on yeah. display. Yeah. On display. Oh, so and, oh and here's a great example, right? Yeah. And it could have been just because... Daniel is called and appointed, right? Right. I'm not saying that. But here in the scripture, it says that um, Daniel, only I, Daniel, Daniel 10, 7, only I, Daniel, saw the vision. The men who were with me did not see it, but a great terror fell on them, and they ran and hid. So they knew something was going they on. They knew something was going on. But only on. Daniel could see it. Don't you why? love how we say? Why? <laughs> exactly. Why? You know, why? You answer. Go back and read it. Yeah. I love how we're like, we're not going to read it for them. Okay. Then okay. It. And then I wanted to, because I wanted to be funny. There was this part. So <laughs> Daniel 10, 9. Daniel saying, I heard the words he said. And when I heard them, I fell into a deep sleep with my face to the ground. This man done passed out. <laughs> there was no deep sleep Daniel you passed out yeah, you passed what is going out. on you know, I understood it yeah I, you know like oh, come on goodness. let's be real Daniel passed, Daniel passed out I remind y'all he was not drunk no there was, he did not eat any meat no wine all of that it was like, any, any rich hungry? food you know Boo yeah. passed out. He, was, passed he, out. He, he understood it so much. He was so Why? weak. He was understood so much the baby was weak right and the Lord had to tell him something yeah. so we're going to tell you yeah. what the Lord told him it's because some of us, we can hear things, we can see the writing yes, on the walls, and it can yes. make us feel sick, and yeah. it could grieve us. I yeah. remember when I was in a moment where the Lord was telling me something that took me out, that made me sick, mm. that I didn't want, I, I wanted that situation to to end differently. Yes. You know? Yes, yes. And it wasn't going to happen. Mm-mm. And Mm-mm. I had to get up. Yeah. Yeah. I had to, and I had to not be afraid. And right. I had to move forward because there's yeah. a promise. Because the Lord was on my side. Yep. And yep. we'll see what comes here. And Jesus had to help me. And we want to know and if you've said. been through something like that before. Yeah. You know, something that you wanted it to go a certain way. Yes. And it could not. And it was important that it did not. And it was important that it did not. And you may not know that the, it was important that it did not yet. Yeah. But we just want to know, have you experienced something like that before? Yeah. Where you wanted a certain ending, but that did not happen. Yeah. So we're going to... Hold on. I wanna... You said it started at 12? I did, but I think we should start... Okay. Ugh. I'm trying to talk when the, when the man yeah. starts talking to him. Okay, well, let's start in 10. All right, 10. Daniel 10, 10. That's where we're starting. Suddenly, a hand touched me and set me shaking on my hands and knees. Yeah. He was scared. Of course. Like, some, you know, you don't so see So he passed nothing. out. You passed out. A he's, hand touching you. You're like, he, where is this coming from? And he's still. And he's still. Okay. Yeah, you and agree. You agree. And, yeah. he's, and he's afraid. So he said to me, Daniel, you are a man treasured by God. When I read this earlier today, I said, dang, that is so beautiful. Yes. And again, this is what the Lord yes. how he feels about us. Yes. You are a woman treasured by treasured God. Treasured by God. You are his daughter. Understand the words that I'm saying to you. Stand on your feet. That's what yeah. I said. I had to get up. Yeah. Don't. And to me, this is. Don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. He was trembling. He was shaking. He was it's shaking. like, stand up. Stand up. For I have now been sent to you. After he said this to me, I stood trembling. He said, still. I'm still, I'm still, still shaking in my boots, but still. at least I'm standing up now. Still. <laughs> Don't be afraid. Daniel, he said to me, for from the first day that you proposed to understand mm-hmm. and to humble, humble yourself before, before God, God, your prayers were heard. What did she say earlier? What if say? my people who are called by my name will humble themselves and pray. Yes. Ugh. And then seek his face and turn from evil ways. But hey, those are the instructions. 
humble yourselves yeah. and pray. And you know what? Some people cannot cannot even pray. There are people who do not believe and they won't even pray. Why? Because they cannot humble themselves. Yes. So I need for us to understand that when we humble ourselves, even in the act of doing that, we are doing something for God that he treasures. Yes. I love, I had to go back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Because don't be afraid, Daniel, he yes. said to me. For from the first day that you were purposed. Yep. Yes. That purpose, that gets yes. us. So you guys know we're biblical life coaches and we help women find their purpose. And so it's like from the first day, yeah. you had purpose. You yeah. understood. Yes, yes. From the yep. first time. Yep. When, yep. The, when the Lord spoke purpose, that's before you were here. Before you were forming your mother's womb, he, he, he knew the plan. Yeah. He knew the plan for Daniel. Mm -hmm. Daniel could understand before. Yes. Before he yes. had it. Yes. Humble yourself. Yep. Humble yourself. Humble yourself. That's good. Yeah, cause you, cause you, cause you know it all. Humble yourself. Yes. Okay. Because you, we know that you know. Yep. We know. Yeah. She likes to say we know Ruth. It's a inside yeah, joke it to is, her family. It is. I'm like we know Ruth. <laughs> we like, know Ruth. We know. Humble yourself, Ruth. Yes, humble. We got to humble ourselves. Yeah, even when we know. Even yep. Yep. We still have to humble because we don't know. Because we all. don't know all the things. We, we don't, don't know, know what God is trying to put into place. Yes. And but He knows why, because He goes before us. Yeah. So He knows, and sometimes we're like, I don't want to make this step. Yeah. Sometimes we're saying, Lord, this is scary. This is so scary, Father. You know, I don't know what's going to happen. Yeah. I don't know the expected end. You know yeah. it. I don't know it. I don't know it. Yeah, but God does. You may have understanding, yeah. but you don't know the proper steps. Yeah. So, okay. So I see that we have some people pop on. We are on verse 13, Daniel 10, yes. verse 13. But the prince of the kingdom of Persia opposed me for 21 mm. days. Then Micah, one of the chief princes, came to help me after I had been left there with the kings of Persia. Now I have come to help you understand what will happen to your people in the last days, for the vision refers to those, right? Because we still talk about the last days. We're still talking about Daniel yeah. not being able to yeah. see it, and but he understands what's going to happen, and he still agrees. We're yep. still talking about yep. it. Yeah. Go ahead. I'm passing. Okay. Back. So while he was saying these words to me, I turned my face toward the ground and was speechless. Suddenly, one with human likeness touched my lips. I opened my mouth and said to the one standing in front of me, "My Lord, because of the vision, anguish overwhelms me, and I am powerless." Right. And so that's once again, you're feeling these things, come to God. Let him know how you're feeling. Lord, I feel powerless. Yeah. You know, I feel like there's nothing that I can do. Right? Yeah. And so he goes on to say, um, how can someone like me, your, your servant, speak with someone like you, my Lord? Now I have no strength. It's, there is no breath in me. And this is so good right here. Right? Then the one with the human appearance yeah. touched me again and mm -hmm. strengthened me. And that is what God does. He strengthens us when we are weak. And we say that we are powerless and he is the only one who can do it because guess what i can go get this cup of coffee yeah right and that might make me feel better for a little bit but only he right only he can give me the true strength that i need yeah only you know he. only he can do that and so um okay so then 18 um 19 he said don't be afraid you who are treasured by god peace to you be very strong as he spoke to me, I was strengthened, and he said, let my Lord speak, for you have strengthened me. Um, but I think what I really liked the most or wanted to get out of this was that, once again, Sierra said it, but when we pray, God hears us. Yeah. But sometimes there can be a delay. And that reminded me of, I had to go look it up, it's Habakkuk 2, 3, which yeah. says that, though it delays, wait for it yeah since it will certainly come and not be late yeah and my mom said this once and i didn't get it she was like though it tarry wait for it since it will come but it won't be late and it was like what what was it because if you think about it what? though it <laughs> delay wait for it because it won't be late it won't be late so, and we are all in situations, I'm telling you, where it's like, Lord, when you gonna come? Lord, when you gonna come? Because I need you to come now. 
But but you're late. You're tearing. Tell them. It the, feels like you're late. Tell them what you told me. Oh my God! There's a movie. There, <laughs> there's there's a silly movie called uh, Lottery Ticket. And so there's a comedian and he's pretending to be a pastor. He's and he and he's up there preaching. And he's like, um, he may not come when you want him, but he always there when you want him. And it's like, sir, that's not that's not how the saying goes. It's, yeah. it's though he may he may yeah. not when you come, he may not come when you want him, but he's always there on time, yes, right? Yes. And so this kind of reminds me Habakkuk two three kind of reminds me. though in Terry wait for it because it will be on time, yeah. and we just know that his timing. It ain't our timing. It ain't our timing. It ain't our timing. But he did hear us. He did hear us. And he tells us, don't be afraid. Yeah. I'm with you. Be he very is strong. With us. Treasured, you know, we're treasured by God. And to have peace. Yes. And today I was feeling so breathless. Today I was like, Lord, I just feel so breathless. And I remember opening up my Bible mm -hmm. and him saying, I'm with you. Yeah. I'll strengthen you. He's with us. I just felt so powerless and yeah. so you read that and i almost start breaking in tears like i feel so breathless yeah that's one that i just feel so mm -hmm. breathless today yeah and to open up his word and for him to say that and then for us to read it yes and he's like i ain't done ministering that to your heart mm -mm. i'm here mm -mm. and so all of us we just have to remember that the Lord is with, with us. us. Always remember. Always. Even yeah. when we don't feel it. Even when we don't feel it. Even right? though what we want tarries. Even what we want tarries. Even though when it, to God it's not a delay. To us it's delayed. Yeah. It's late. It's past due. It got an eviction notice on it. Yeah. Because I needed that thing three months ago, right? Yeah. Right. At, at this time, I'm like, Lord, if you had a credit report, I'd report it because you're three months <laughs> late. <laughs> yeah. I'd report it, Lord, because you're late. But he's like, no, 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 Keep I going. am not late. I'm, yeah, he's not late. His timing yeah. is the perfect timing. Be very strong. I love this translation. It said be very strong. Yep. So yep. be very strong. But guess what? He's our strength. Yeah. And yeah. so you see that be very strong. It's okay. I'm sitting here like a little crying little baby. And the Lord strengthening me. He's got me. Yep. yep. I feel breathless, so he has to breathe for me. Yes. And so anyway. And so when we're feeling those things, we tell him. Oh yeah. We I just love him. it just says, As he spoke to me, I was strengthened and yep. said, Lord, let my Lord speak, for you have strengthened me. He said, Do you know why I've come to you? Ugh. Anyway, keep keep going anyway but, but that's a good ugh. that's a good testament when we're feeling those things we need to go listen to things right yeah. that will strengthen us and that will encourage us because we we can all feel those things we yeah. can all get depleted energy sucked out yeah we can yeah. and i love yeah. i love here it just talks about the book of truth we know our book of truth is the bible and it's saying everything being recorded here yeah right and it, having that understanding anyway so it's just that reminder to to all of us to have courage and that our support our help comes from him but if we want to know if we want to find truth this is the only truth that we have that's it this is the only truth that's that we it. have that's it so be very strong be courageous just, do the work do the work fear not and do not be dismayed because he is with, with you us. he is with us and so we leave you with that. Yeah. We yeah. leave you with that. Um, so girl. 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 Open, open your, your Bible. Bible.